Welcome to the classiest malt liquor reviews on YouTube. A few years ago I did a review of Four Loco, which was well received. And today I would like to review a beverage that I found in the aisles of our new Walmart neighborhood market. So the regular grocery stores that Walmart is opening all over the country, we have one. And right in the microbrew section, let's see, what's near us right now? We have Highland Brewing, RJ Rockers in Spartanburg, Thomas Creek in Greenville, Sierra Nevada in Asheville. All these breweries have amazing beers, and Walmart Neighborhood uh, Markets is featuring a lot of local microbrews. Right in there, with those beers, was Happy Juice Express. Boys and girls, Happy Juice Express. I'm so excited. There is no flavor label. I only saw this, so I assume it's their only beverage. It is 12% alcohol by volume. Let's pop this bad boy open and go to town. This bottle, by the way, cost me uh, I think three dollars and it is 24 ounces here we go fun little uh, bottle cap by the way smiley face I have to say the packaging is honestly attractive to me it's fun it's pretty I want to drink it here I have a glass for an ice cream sundae I'm going to use it for this fine beverage All right, let's get reviewing. Let's position this bottle attractively, huh? There we go, all right. What do we have? We have a straight Kool-Aid color. No variation. The light doesn't really impact it very much, so I'm just gonna go straight to smelling. It's fruit punch. It's a fruit punch flavor, which is what this color should be. I'm going to put uh, my bowl of exhausted rooster to the side so I can do justice to the flavor. All right, here we go with fruit punch flavored Happy Juice Express. Oh, man. You know, I don't think I'd ever had a malt beverage before I had that Four loco and reviewed it. This has in common with that a disheartening bitterness. It's hard to mask with uh, the very sweet flavor. Yeah, fruit, uh, fruit punch flavor. Very sweet. Very sweet. Sweeter than Four Loco. I can tell you that much. And the smell is the funnest part of the whole thing. It's straight up uh, smells like uh, smells like fruit punch. All right. I don't really think I have much else to say about this, except that it seems to be a shining example of everything that flavored malt beverages should be. Cheers. Prost.